Hey everybody, this is Alan Fine. I'm here with Joe Jiffo, who is the Vice President of Sales for American Queen Voyages, which was formerly American Queen Steamboat Company, Victory Cruises, and I think that's it. That's it. All that's right. It. Yeah. But, but it felt like more because there was so much going on. Right. Anyway, we're here to talk about the announcement of the new brand and what that means for you, the travel advisor, on Insider Travel Report. First, let's start. I mean, the itineraries are blossoming along with this uh, announcement. So let's let's talk about that. Yeah. So with part of our with the new branding and American Queen Voyages with the Victory Cruise Line brand actually going away, we were able to put it all under one brand. So we now have American Queen Voyages River, River. American Queen Voyages Lake and Lakes and Ocean, and American Queen Voyages Expedition. Expedition. So with that, also brings some new itineraries that we've announced and we're bringing into 2022. That unfortunately we weren't able to do in 2021 so some great new itineraries one of course our Great Lakes which is our core product on our American Queen voyages ocean and lakes and right we hit all five lakes we hit uh, Canada and the Atlantic coast right so that's one then we go to the southeast United States we do a round trip Amelia Island and we hit these beautiful southern southern charm cities like Savannah Charleston Brunswick Georgia um, Beaufort, South Carolina. And then we go up to West Palm Beach, out to Freeport, just we have to touch our international port. Brand new, it's getting some ray reviews in terms of... Um, so these are the victory, formerly the, the victory, victory ships now coming out and around and going south. Correct, and it's under our ocean and lakes product, right? It's called our Southeast Coast, um, and we hit these beautiful Southern Charm cities, right? So that that's brand new. The other new, itinerary is our Yucatan Peninsula, brand new starting in January, and we'll we'll leave out of Cozumel and we'll come back out of Cancun. In between that, we have this immersion kind of uh, like Tulum uh, overnight hotel, fantastic. Four voyages to start 2022 is starting in January, so very excited about that. But, but okay. each one of them is, is immersive to the point where you have that new slogan is important. Yeah, discovery runs deep, right? right. It's, uh, it's all about it's the guest experience and, and the immersion into our land our land excursion right so so that's brand new and then our expedition product right this was this is our brand new ocean victory and then 2023 ocean discover we were supposed to launch this year but we are extremely excited about this alaska product it's vancouver sitka sitka vancouver and and we'll hit um we'll hit into the misty fjords we'll get up into tracy tracy arm but this is an example of um, the size of this ship is getting you into places where I haven't heard other people going. Correct. It's 200 passengers, brand new. It's got the X bow, so it's got the the the, the, the low quiet emission six stabilizers. You know, stabilizers, um, and so it's it's a fantastic new vessel. We were supposed to bring it out this year. We are excited about the ocean, our Ocean Victory, and then the sister ship, Ocean Discover in 2023 so we'll have two 200 passenger sister sister vessels in the expedition alaska expedition market all right so is that does that cover it so that covers that covers the, the new product right that covers the product under our ocean and lakes division and under our um expedition and we also have a canada new england product as well which is you know we get into um we go into Bo well boston and could bar harbor and you know uh uh, Providence for Lyme, Martha's Vineyard. So that's that's a new product as well. The Mississippi and the uh, Pacific Northwest, those those are tried and true. They're staying the same. No changes? No changes at all. I mean, those are our bread and butter on the river products, right? So we have our tributaries with those, you know, the Ohio River and the Illinois River and the Cumberland. But but our, you know, our our core product is the Mississippi, right? The lower Mississippi. So that nothing changes there. Okay, good. So so our travel advisors want to know how to get involved. What what programs have you got for them? Yeah, so first I'll first and foremost I'll tell you with our expanded sales force. We have created new territories we have increased our sales support team where we now have a couple of different things we have uh, a, an expedition sales team which is led by scott harner and we'll have uh, two regional account managers and by the way we're going away from business development managers and we're moving to regional account managers and then we ha also have eight regional account managers new territories um, out throughout the united states so calling on our travel advisors so you right? can really focus on each of these areas so yeah. no one's no one's going to be stretched 
there's nobody is stretched where our go our biggest goal is to get new travel advisors new to the brand that's what's so important for us is that that you if you've never sold us before you need to reach out to us you need to call me you need to call our sales support team and we can share that with you joe jiffo at aqvoyages.com right um, and we'll be able to help you so that that's one great new tool that we have and we've expanded that just in the last five months we're also we've added uh, a director of sales service and supports so we have a sales service and support division now that supports our bdms and it supports our travel advisors so if an agent you know, has any type of a request or an issue, whatever they need, they don't have to call into our reservation 1-800 number and go to service. They can go directly to this new sales service and support division led by Lisette Martinez, and we have a support team there to help them. So that's, that's one thing that we have. Then we have all of these new, what we're calling fall promotions. So if our travel advisors out there that have customers that have a future cruise credit, on another cruise line and they're, maybe they don't want to travel international right now, they want to stay close to home. We'll take a value of that future cruise credit, so up to $600 per stateroom, and put it towards an American Queen Voyages. You're saying if if they have a future cruise credit with any other line? Any other line. You'll honor it in that respect, that we'll, way? We'll honor it up to $600 right. per stateroom. And, and they, they can keep it. And they keep it. Right. They get to use it, so they get to use it if they're planning on going on the XYZ, in 2022, they get to use it, right? They just show us a, a proof that they have it, and we we want them to sail. We want them to take advantage of our close to home opportunities. And this is for for 2021. We have opportunities left in 2021. So so that's a, another big one. Then we have a bunch of other promotions that come up. So we have these road shows, as you know, that are going on through throughout the the, the Northeast, the Midwest and the west coast and we're doing eight roaches and so we're, any of the agents that are attending these roaches and we have over 750 agents that will be seeing our presentation we're giving them an extra one percent commission right and if they come on they make their first booking with us you get one percent you make five bookings with us you get an extra one percent so those are the two big promotions and then we'll be announcing a series of other promotions coming up in november and then as we get through to close to wave but a lot of exciting opportunities with us. So if someone wants to get that 1%, where are the next towns coming up? It's a good question. So here we are in New York. Tomorrow's Boston, then Philadelphia. And then next week we'll be in Washington, D.C., followed by Chicago. The following week we'll be in San Francisco, and then Marina del Rey, and then San Diego. Now, they can find all this out where? So they can go, they can actually call us at our 800 number or reach out to myself or any of our salespeople and then we'll share with them the, the opportunity, right? So you can, you can again, So what's out. the 800 number? So you can actually call me, I mean, call, call actually email me because then I, be, de, being, depending on where they're based and I can lead them to the right direction. Again, it's joe.jiffo at aqvoyages.com, right? And that's the easiest way to, to yeah. And, and, then, they, and is there a website that travel advisors should go to? Yeah, so it's aqvoyages.com, which is our brand new website. Um, and then we have a brand new, beautiful uh, portal that they can see our new videos. And then we we have our travel agent certification program that um, that's an opportunity. You've always had that, but it's enhanced now. And it's being redone. And you take you take our travel agent certification program, and then you have an opportunity to sail on our vessels. Right? We have our, our brand new travel agent program, sail a travel agent rate one hundred and twenty five dollars per person per day. Right? And again, that includes all of your beverages, all your shore excursions, and it's an opportunity for our travel advisors to see our product and really get to experience. And we haven't been able to do that. In, in almost two years, right? You raise a good question. Um, what is all-inclusive on an American Queen voyage? Yeah. So all-inclusive starts with your hotel stay, right? So we have a, a pre-hotel stay where you check into one of our pre-hotel our hotel products, and that's where you do your check-in. So you get your you get your room key. We do the pre um, the pre-COVID testing, which is so important. And then the next day you have breakfast, and then we transfer you and your luggage to to the vessel, and then you sail, and then you have your shore excursions where we have our hop-on, hop-off shore excursions. Love that. Yeah, it's fantastic of course all of your all of your beverages including that's your coffee that's your wines your spirits your beer I mean and it's all and this is something new that we started a year ago right and so what that has done it's made it an easy sale for our travel advisors it's made it to where we have a nice a nice ticket price yeah, right? and, and it's, it's all commissionable it's all it's all commissionable and 
it has a nice, uh, like I say, has a comma in our commission, uh, in our commission number to the to the agents, right? And so they love that. Um, so yeah, so we have a lot going on, and we're excited. We're excited to to continue our road shows, and then in 2022 we will do what we're calling road show part two and we'll go to florida we'll go to texas we'll probably go up to canada so we'll be adding new cities onto this road show uh we're going out to ninety thousand travel advisors more than and is there a final message you want them to know yeah so thank you for all that you do we know that 2020 and 2021 was very difficult we have this close to home product that we think that your customers we know your customers will love um reach out to us training anything that you need from us we we appreciate you know the support that you've given us and the fact that you are so critical to the success of our industry we're here to support you in every way joe thank you for talking to us thanks alan appreciate it and this is alan fine for insider travel report